All right, I thought I'd do an update to start this day. It's a big day. Um, we are just leaving Vero Beach. You can see some boats all around us and that bridge in front of us uh, all rafted up. Um, we have been here for two weeks and two days, and uh, it was a great stay. We really enjoyed ourselves here, did play some pickleball. Main thing was got a lot of stuff done in the boat, got it ready to go. Um, today, we are just going to motor about 12 miles down to Fort Pierce, uh, inlet and we'll just anchor there tonight uh, the plan is tomorrow we will sail on the outside because there is a bridge that is inoperable a, uh, a lift bridge uh, that is inoperable down uh, south of there between there and Lake Worth and we need to get there so what we'll do is uh, uh, make that sail tomorrow is the plan uh, we're gonna try it anyway and then we will uh, uh, sail the following day, uh, leave early morning, and try to make the crossing over to West End Bahamas. Um, so we're excited, we're a little nervous, but uh, we're ready to go. So I think uh, uh, you know Kim's just getting the deck squared. We got a uh, full tank of gas, full tank of water. Um, everything looks ready. So uh, here we go. Uh, wish you luck. Talk to you later. Okay, we'll do an update this morning. We got a beautiful sunrise over here. Um, the crew is working hard and getting the boat squared away. <laughs> We've got uh, three to four feet of uh, swell this morning. Uh, we're off of Fort Pierce. We came out of Fort Pierce a little before seven this morning. And we are now uh, motor sailing. Uh, we got very little wind, uh, about four or five knots behind, actually on our uh, starboard aft quarter um, we'll hopefully get a better angle later and to be able to do a little bit of sailing we'll see um, but anyway uh, we're making progress south uh, headed to uh, Lake Worth today uh, uh, West Palm Beach and 
to stage ourselves for uh, tomorrow's uh, expected crossing to the Bahamas. So um, West End uh, in uh, the Abacos on uh, Grand Bahama. So anyway, uh, I was concerned about this swell being super uncomfortable and uh, not perfect, but not bad. So uh, we'll take it. And uh, we're able to make six knots right now, um, which is what we need to do today uh, to get down to uh, West Palm by about four. Uh, our projected time right now is three o'clock, but I don't think we'll be able to go this speed the whole day. We'll be facing some uh, Gulf Stream current. We're hugging the coast pretty close. We're about, uh, I don't know, a little ways off, but we're in 32 feet of water. So uh, just got to watch our depth gradient and uh, run right along this and hopefully the Gulf Stream will, be, will stay out there uh, and not bash us in. I know we're going to face it when we come into the up to the inlet on the other side. So anyway, that's our thing, our situation. Uh, hope you're having a good day. This is the beginning of our big adventure. We're excited about it. Hopefully uh, uh, you can follow along. Talk to you soon. Well, I guess it's time I should do an update this morning. It's kind of a big day. We uh, left West Palm Beach this morning and that is the deep blue ocean right there. Um, we are in about 1700 feet of water uh, right in the middle of the Gulf Stream we are motoring along and making about 4.7 knots right now uh, probably need to adjust angle a little bit try because we're actually fighting the Gulf Stream right now um, but anyway uh, we've been working for a long time to get to this point and uh, we're pretty excited about it we've gone about uh, 16, I'm probably close to 17 miles from West Palm and we're going to go about 56 to get to West End on Grand Bahama. So have about 40 miles to go. Uh, we've got uh, boats, can't see them right now, but they're all around us uh, on AIS, uh, a couple of which we know. So um, I think we're in pretty good shape. Uh, we'll just uh, cruise along. Hopefully we're going to get some wind to come in there uh, later in the day uh, and uh, we can actually start sailing more we tried to sail a little bit earlier but it, it just the wind has just been really flaky got a really nice big four foot swell but at about 12 seconds so the big long easy swells so anyway hope your day is as good as ours we'll talk to you soon just came up oh wow uh, we've been getting a little bit of a gusty breeze here and there um, but the good news is uh, we're sailing uh, we are about two-thirds of the way across from West Palm to uh, West End and uh, everything looks good um, everything we've been we motor sailed up until about I don't know, 30 minutes ago and uh, we've been sailing now moving along at uh, between five and six knots uh, on about uh, 12 knots of wind pretty far forward of the beam but um, this is kind of just sweet spot she likes this a lot and uh, so we're ripping along pretty good uh, but uh, we'll make West End today for sure if uh, everything continues to go well and uh, I'm not sure we'll be able to check in today or we may have to do that in the morning, but um, we should make it before dark by a good margin. So that's where we are. Um, and uh, hopefully uh, the rest of the trip will continue to go as smoothly as it's gone so far. Talk to you soon. Well, I should do an update this morning. We are in the Bahamas. <laughs> it's so nice. And we decided just to go ahead and grab a slip here at Old Bahama Bay Marina last night. It was blowing pretty hard out there when we came in and the anchor just didn't look good at all. It probably would have been fine, but anyway, we had a nice night last night hanging out with some people uh, that we've met along the way. Um, it was really cool to catch up with uh, Rich and Laura that we had met in Washington. They sailed in just in front of us, maybe an hour. But anyway, uh, got beautiful water this morning right here in the, in the slip. Uh, got the crew on deck 
swabbing the decks. So that's good. So I'll get in trouble for that one later. But anyway, uh, so here's a look around. It is so pretty here. And uh, what's really nice, the customs office is just right over there. Um, but what's really nice is there's some really nice condos here. And, uh, you know, right here to the back side of the, uh, you know, this is the inside over here. Um, so it looks nice and calm out there this morning. And these condos are, you know, of course, for rent. And then they have um, Tiki Bar over there and a restaurant over there. And, yeah, looks like a cool place. Everybody's on deck. They, we surprisingly have water available to us at no additional charge this morning. So yeah, we gotta clean the salt off the boat and and get it ready to go for the probably the last time we'll see water at dock in a long time. So we've only seen it I don't know four times on this entire uh, almost three month now trip. So anyway, there it is. Hope you're having a good day. We're having a amazing day.